Okay, guys, uh, there were lots of Christmas goodies this week. And I wanted to pick up a few things to put in the booth. Things that I thought would go in a farmhouse decor, in a coffee bar. Just some little basic things. I think that was $1.99. So um, it was half price for seniors. So I did get a lot of these things half price. So the little candlestick was a dollar. Um, the birdhouse, I think, was $1.50. Let's see what else we got. That was kind of kind of neat, kind of farmhouse looking, but I left it. Oh, I liked this. So this was a $1.99, and the blue was not on sale. So I did pay $1.99 for that um, gingerbread uh, creamer. And what did that say? If it said $1.99, it was $1.99. <laughs> I was enamored with this little puppet show. Um, whatever thingy. I had to get that bunny out of the way so I could turn it around. I was really enamored with this. I actually thought really hard about taking this. It's like, how much is this damn thing? Okay, six bucks, five ninety nine. I was not gonna leave puppet show in it. Oh, look at this. This is farmhousey. Two ninety nine. Gotta go. We'll do a haul video also. Because I got a lot of good stuff. I took the Christmas tree tin because it was 99 cents. Did I say 99 cents? Because that was blue. I was on sort of like on overload. I thought about this little elf guy. Um, $1.99. <clears throat> I thought about putting him up on my chandelier. <laughs> but I didn't. I didn't at this point I didn't know what color was on was not on sale. Cuz today everything was on sale except one color. And that was blue. I have several sleighs I need to alter, so I left that guy behind. Hmm. There's a lot of stuff here. Gosh, I'm not really picking anything up, am I? Ooh, what did I pass those green things? Okay, Little Piggy I thought about, but uh, Little Piggy was super light, so Piggy had to stay. Not too terribly much on this aisle. Yep, thought about that. Let's keep going. Oh, look at these little mice. They were reading a book about cats. So cute. I watch Crazy Lamp Lady and she often uh, picks up little critter things, but she sells on eBay and I don't have enough following yet to be doing that. Ooh, I liked that. Oh my gosh, I didn't go back and get that. At, like I said, at this point, I didn't know which color was not on sale. So it's being kind of cautious. I really usually like finding things in the wood section that we can alter, but God, everything had heart cutouts on it. And we all know heart cutouts is not in style right now. And then in this aisle, it's like, what is that? What do you do with that? Um, this aisle usually has candlesticks. 
I was really hoping for candlesticks. That was kind of cool. $4.99. But again, not sure what color it was. <laughs> not on sale. And blue was the one. That was kind of a neat little set. I should have got that. This, I liked this too, but I think it was priced a little bit high. $5.99, even for $3, I thought that was a little bit much. For the thrift store anyway. Okay, let's continue. <sighs> Piggy bank. All right. Now I am scouring for the candlesticks. There are not many um, wooden or resin candlesticks. There were a lot of um, metal. Oh, look at the little birdie. $4.99. I mean, that's a high for that teeny little bird. If that had been $1.99, I'd have grabbed it. Okay, let's see. Oh, man. Why is that even out? Why would anybody buy that? They should recycle that. Throw in the dumpster. These were $4.99 each, and they were not 50% off. Okay, let's see this. $6.99? I guess they thought because it had the wrong size candle, it should be worth a lot. You can see I'm moving a little fast. Sorry, guys. Kind of making me a little bit dizzy. Alrighty. A lot of glass here. Hmm. That's different. I call that hobnail, I think. It's funny how sometimes I see something that's been there for months, and I'm like... When do you guys purge this stuff? Hmm. Yeah. Baskets actually have been selling well in the booth. Look at this thing. $9.99. What is that? Oh, it's an ashtray. $9.99? My gosh, how many people actually need an ashtray in their house? Hopefully they don't smoke in their house. Well, this was a cute little container. I wish it hadn't had the Christmas tree on it. Yeah, I think after the holidays, I'm going to make me a nice big basket uh, collection. Okay, now this. I thought that would be beautiful. Distressed. I think it said $4.99 and it was 50% off. But when I got to the front, I found out that wasn't their tag. Why wouldn't they take that off or cover it up? Huh? So it was like $8.99 and I said, oh no. Not even at 50% off am I going to pay $4 for that. Okay. The cow caught my eye, but it's a toothbrush holder. Does anybody do farmhouse bathroom? Well, I guess maybe. I love these little containers. I don't know why I love those. Little teeny pictures. That one. Oh, that one. Mm -hmm. the one with the butterflies was pretty but I was like I don't have room to store stuff for later on so because that's a, definitely a spring looking item what am I looking at oh yeah those were a little bit pricey for and they were blue tags so they weren't on sale I like canisters with lids, jars with lids. And look at these. Somebody tell me what these are. Because I'm going to show you how many there are. Look how many there are. 
Well, those little spice jars. But what's weird is how do you know what kind of spice is in it? Somebody tell me. It's funny. Oh, oh, love the teapot. It wasn't on sale. And I got this little, uh, let's see. I took that little cutting board. And I'll make a side out of it. I think it was 99 cents. So I got it for 50 cents. I'm checking out the price on this bigger cutting board. And it's not on sale. Did that say $3.99? If that had been on sale, I'd have grabbed it. Taking the rolling pin. Alright, let's see if we got any wooden spoons or anything in here. I eyeball on this big copper looking scoop. $9.99. No, thank you. Although it's kind of cool. Alright, let's look on the other side of the aisle. Uh oh. I'd have totally taken that if it if that cork had, I don't know, it didn't look like it belonged with the cork. That was a pretty ornate bottle. <clears throat> hmm. <gasps> What's this? <coughs> $7.99. But it's on sale. Alright. Initial inspection. Okay, that cow's going home with me. And over to the brass armadillo it goes. That was a really good hunting day. <gasps> Look at these. If you guys follow me, you know I have a collection of beautiful glass cancers in my studio. That I eventually will purge and put in the brass armadillo. Look how that one's got a really heavy top. So I paid $3.50. And that went home. Very heavy. Those were actually good prices. Sometimes I see those up in $12.99 price range. No good red stuff. Oh, you're going to see something funny here. I, this colander caught my eye. Let's see, where is it? There it is. And I was like, oh yeah, I'm going to get that. And I was like, what? $8.99 for a colander? No, thank you. You can stay at the thrift store. By the way, this is the ARC thrift store. Um, not Goodwill. It is a very large store. Everybody always co comments how much stuff it has. And it is a very, very large thrift store. Okay, last aisle of smalls. I did look at furniture and lamps and things, but there wasn't anything exciting, so. Uh-oh, this is a blue tag. Those were kind of cool. I would have taken those if they had been on sale. Get out of my way. Who leaves their car? Oh, I loved this. I loved this. And had it been on sale, it would have come home. I like the other side better with the Santa and the sleigh and stuff. But it was beautiful. And I was really sad. Did I show the price? Dang it. 
Oh, I know if I go back next week, it won't be there. Good morning, Ice Talkers. That's a friendly what? reminder that we have all our Christmas decor coming out. There really we were lots Christmas of Christmas trees. things. We have and a whole, whole lot of <laughs> well, that's kind of cute. Coming out. Um, at this point, I did so know that Christmas. blue was not on sale. Um, hats as well. Now these nut crackers. What? Oh. Oh. The oh, back up. I couldn't Thank see how much they were. Happy uh -huh. and have a happy I holiday. could just see those painted. Oh. Probably should have grabbed them. Okay. I have a friend who really likes penguins. And this was, I think it said $3.99, so it was $2. I checked it over really good. There were no chips. That may be getting mailed to Hawaii. Taking it back out for another look. <laughs> I have a thing for teapots. I don't know why. I don't use teapots. But I love them. Okay, here's a nativity. And it was a really good price. But, you know, Jamie Ray paints her nativities and sells them. And I just, I don't know. I don't think I live in a market that would buy a painted nativity. I just don't. So I opted out of that. This little thing, this was cute, and I thought it would be cute on a coffee bar. But both of the snowmen were missing their noses. Hmm. Little Santa plate down there. I hate it when I'm getting to the end. It makes me sad. Okay, look, there's this little boy, and that one's probably supposed to have a little girl, but nope, she's disappeared. These were actually really reasonably priced, and they're heavy duty. Oh, mugs. Mugs are another uh, sweet pleasure of mine, and I think that one said 99 cents, so that guy went home. Giving this another thought. A wind up tin. Look at all the Christmas trees. Wow. Oh my God, what was that Santa? Was he a cookie jar? Like, no, go for the mug. $1.99, so it's half price. So it's a dollar. Stanley Valdez. Uh -oh, go on home with me. I do get stuff I didn't show you guys, so we'll do a haul video. I was like, trees. I need more trees. I wanted this stool. It was actually a large, not a stool, a step stool. It was a large step stool. How much did that say? Oh my god, my eyes are not focusing. It's very early in the morning. It's like 5 o'clock. Um, Alright, there you go. Thanks for watching, guys.